If you're looking for the Ethernet hubs in this year, you are at the right place. In this video, we're going to show you Ethernet hubs available on Amazon today. We reviewed literally dozens of products, and we made this list based on a number of factors including the features of the product, value for the money, and the reputation of the manufacturer. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. We even read countless reviews from actual users. If you choose from this list, you can be sure that you'll buy one of the best products available today. So make sure to check the product links below in the description, and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Now let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have TP-Link TLS Gun 1008. Like most manufacturers, TP-Link offers both metal and plastic bodied switches. This plastic one is by far the most popular and it's easy to see why. It's better looking, with a much less business-like design. The ports are at the back, but activity lights are at the front, so the cables can be routed away more neatly rather than emerging from the front of the device. Unlike others here, the power socket is on the back, not the sides, again making for neater cable management. If you need to, the Escon 1000A can be wall-mounted. And, again, the TP-Link is better designed than some as the release tabs for the cables remain accessible and not against the wall. Moving on to the next at number 2 with Netgear GS308. Netgear is another well-known networking brand which makes both plastic and metal-bodied Ethernet splitters for home use. We've picked the metal version here because the GS908. The plastic one isn't widely available and it tends to be considerably more expensive when you can find it. The GS308, like other metal switches, has its ports on the front along with status LEDs, so isn't going to look great if it's on show in your living space. As the power cable plugs into the rear, you can simply turn it round. There will still be a cable emerging. Tucked inside, or behind a, a TV cabinet, it's not an issue, and as you'd expect, it's fanless for silent operation. Finally. It's wall-mountable if you need to hang it up. The number 3 position is held by Trendnet Unmanaged Gigabit Switch. Trendnet's Unmanaged Switch comes in 5 and 8 port versions, but both seem to go out of stock regularly. There are both plastic and metal botted versions, with prices varying accordingly. Both are well suited to those on a budget. Remember that as with all hubs, one port will be used to connect it to your router. So there are 4 usable ports on 5 port hubs, and 7 on 8 port hubs. Like the others here, it offers silent operation, low power consumption, and plug and play setup. Next at number 4 we have Netgear Gigabit Ethernet Desktop Switch. Your home router only comes with so many Ethernet ports, so Netgear's Gigabit Ethernet Desktop Switch stands in as an excellent option to expand the capacity. This small and compact switch can fit in neatly with your home's other computer gear. Unlike other options, this one doesn't stand out as a bulky metal box. Additionally, it is easy to use thanks to its plug-and-play operation that doesn't require the use of an external computer. The number 5 position is held by TP-Link Fast Ethernet Switch. If you need Ethernet ports fast, and you are on a budget, check out the TP-Link Fast Ethernet Switch. This small unit boasts up to 8 Ethernet ports for connecting your devices with ease. The switch's built-in power-saving functionality even allows you to save up to 68% in electricity costs as the switch adapts to the current device load. If you need help, TP-Link includes unlimited 24-7 technical support for no extra charge. The tank switching capacity on the switch is fairly reliable. The integrated switch architecture from TP-Link also helps to improve overall network response time. The number 6 position is dominated by Netgear Nighthawk 8000 Ethernet Switch. Gamers know the critical importance of fast networking hardware. If your ping is too high, you can experience delays that will cost you, potentially at the expense of a victory. Netgear steps in with the ultimate solution, a gaming switch that it calls the Nighthawk 8000. Named after an agile predator, the N8000 also moves fast, offering 99% lower latency than most standard switches. If you're looking to give your gaming a competitive edge, consider the best gaming mouse pad too. You will be able to connect and customize the control of up to 8 different devices thanks to the managed port setup quite an advanced feature for a consumer grade switch. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Netgear Persafe G Zone 108 Ethernet Switch. Netgear is a well-known manufacturer of networking products, having a portfolio that covers consumer level devices as well as enterprise type products. Among them, there are power line adapters, routers, NAS devices, wireless VPN firewalls, and per safe switches. Maintaining the theme of the article, I'll focus on an entry-level unmanaged switch, the Netgear Persafe G Zone 108. 
which is suitable for home use, as well as for small business offices. The Netgear Persafe G Zone 108 went through several revisions, the latest being V4, but it has kept the same design, looking very similar to pretty much every other switch on the market. It doesn't really excel from the aesthetic point of view, but switches are all about practicability. Finally, the number 8 position is dominated by Lynx's LG Zone 116 16 port Ethernet switch. The Lynx's LG Zone 116 is an unmanaged 16 port network switch that is part of the Lynx's business desktop Gigabit Post Switch series, along with the LG Zone 108 and LG Zone 124, an 8 port device, and, respectively, a 24 port switch. The LG Zone 116 is a great solution for your office network, but it can also be used in your home. The LG Zone 116 features a fairly large rectangular metallic case. But comparing it with other 16-port switches, it's surprisingly compact. With two pairs of airflow vents on the left and on the right, and no internal fan, it relies solely on passive cooling. The top of the LG Zone 116 is quite plain, with only the Blue Lynx's logo breaking the continuity of the black matte finish. That's all for today. We upload tech product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.